Alcade invited you on an adventure for training. Right. Hey everyone, this is GT. Another installment of Let's Play Dante G Volume 2 Reminiscence just arrived. <coughs> Previously. Oh, by the way, Hidden Forbidden Hades is Wailing Captain Vadubishlag. I forgot what we did. Um, I think we did. Yeah, we did the Hiragi fight, and now today we're gonna do some training with Alcade. All right, time to begin training for the semifinal. We're Without Adelie. For our team. Oh yeah, that's right, because she's at the, the uh, she's at the doctor. Is effective teamwork. If we all work together properly to protect Adelie, our party stability will be that much stronger. Oh, of so, course. How are we going to train for this? It's better to learn these kinds of things physically rather than mentally. Which means we have to do a shit ton of fights. Let's just go hunt us up some monsters. Got it. Let's go. Which I guess I don't really have too much of a problem with. Might take a little while, but hey, why not? Kick the tree! Oh my god, a King Jim Jim! King! He gets bigger when you kick him. Your foot turns him on. Check this out. Look at all that chimmy. You actually get about 50 chim from that. Yeah, that's a, uh, that, that was, th th that's, I, I didn't expect that to happen. Body slam! I'm a little, oh crap, I, I gotta, I gotta switch my, uh, awakening off of, off of Divine, because I can only do that with three party members. Just be aware that if you ever do something like this where you don't have all three party members, just remember that you can't use Divine Awakening unless you have all three. Lay Zen, that means that he uses light attacks. Because, like, Lay Zos is the light laser attack. He's weak to Chaotic Strike, but screw that, I'm leveling up my Scythe. Speaking of leveling up, I've been playing Killing Floor recently, though I've kind of stopped because I've leveled up all my perks except for Medic. Because that one takes a long time to level up. Well, I mean, you gotta do it online. Ah, uh, and I've also started... I've actually... I finished uh, Warriors of Roachie 3 recently. That was really, really fun. I got all three endings, the normal, good, and true ending. I actually got the good ending, then the normal ending, then the true ending. Which is kind of odd. You would think that it would be like the other way around, but no. Um. It, there we go. So now that I've gotten that, I'm pretty much done with the game. I mean, obviously, I'm still gonna hold on to it because I can still, you know, do some grinding, get some achievements sometime in the future if I feel like it. But for the most part, I'm done with this. So I've decided to move on to another Xbox game that I've had for a while but haven't gotten around to playing. And that. Shit. Is. Blue Dragon. And it's actually pretty good. I, I, I'm really liking it. And Alcade, you're coming back up. Um, uh, strategery, we're going to have you on life. Oh, by the way, I got Shellbreaker a while back. I didn't get to show it off. There it is. Crap. Crap. I wanted to, I wanted to block. I think after this, I'm just going to cut out a lot of the other fights, because at this point, I don't have anything interesting to say. No. 
it's not that the game's boring. I mean, it's definitely fun, but it's just like the Warrior seems, where since things can be... Since things can get repetitive, you, you run out of things to talk about. And this is the reason why... Yeah, you see me talk about... I might talk about the Warriors games a lot, and I really do love them. But it's not a game that I would do a Let's Play on. And it, again, you saw what happened when uh, King Toot 6 and I did uh, a video or two on Dynasty Warriors Gunner. I just talked about how, like, oh, I don't have anything to say, don't have anything to say. And that was pretty much true. Alright, so I think what I'm going to do... I'm just going to... I'm just going to cut to, like, the boss. Because there really isn't much to show. Oh! We got a thing. After you hit the first warp, hey, you get this thingy. Hmm? Do you know what happened to Andrance after the tournament? Hmm? Endrance? I haven't heard anything about Do you know what happened to Elk? I mean, mean Endrance? I see. Besides, I can't talk about epitaphs and Ida with Alcade. I can't I... talk with her. She's a girl. I, I saw Endrance <laughs> after that. I'm already up to 18 minutes recording. This is ridiculous. He looked like he'd been hollowed out from the My inside. My levels are really, really, like, really low. I don't know. Like he had had his life drained from him. It was just like seeing a ghost. Uh, what the? Uh, 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 a ghost? Rawr! 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 In case you didn't pick up on it, I was trying to imitate King Boom Boo. Mia. Have you seen Mia? I believe she was gathering some aromatic grass. What the heck are you talking about? Hey! Andrus! It's me! Don't you recognize me? I can't find her. She's disappeared. My beautiful Mia. Oh, you'll get over it, Endrance. Would you look at yourself? Pull yourself together! I don't believe this. You are the same guy who defeated me, aren't you? Where could my Mia have gone? Huh? Wait! Hey! I said wait! Endrance! It's all my fault if I just hadn't lost. Huh. Please, I promise I won't lose next time. Please. I'm not sure how characters can make Mia. these complex body expressions Mia. with my a controller. Mia. Cause remember, I mean they do play these games with a controller. Because well, Adelie we've specifically kind of mentioned Shall we head back? that she bought a controller that she could only use yeah. with one hand. Anyway, where are we? We got a few more places to go, so again, I'm going to cut to where there's another scene. Or to we reach the boss. Alrighty. We gotta fight a big owl thingy. That's the boss. I don't even know what it's called, but I'm gonna ram into it. Okay. The sorcerer owl. Oh god, this thing has 3,000 health. Okay, this will probably take a long time. This is not good. Adelie's going to take a shit ton of damage already. Um, but he's weak to this, so, um. No, but I, I, I don't know. I, I, I don't know if I'm going to live through this. Adelaide's probably going to die. Or not Adelaide, Alcade will probably die. 
Okay, get away. Oh, cool. That's a favorite action. That's that. That's a good thing. All right. Yeah. Um. I'm just gonna cut to the end because this is gonna take way too long. Aw, oh, yeah. Took down the Sorcerer Owl. Only had like one Rangeki, though. Lit Honeysuckle. Yeah, we gotta get rid of something else. <laughs> Alright. Now. Basically, uh, I got to the point where Adelie was just getting... This guy was just dropping down to the ground and killing Adelie every other turn. So I figured, you know, Adelie's gonna die otherwise. Anyway. And apparently, healing her when she's in critical health is a favorite action of hers. So basically, I just used weird black teas. They actually have a function. It was only restoring 50 HP, but also 50 SP. So when she would die right before it would get to the point where you need a revival medicine, I would just use a, a weird black tea. It would restore 50 SP. It would restore enough, he enough health to you know bring her back to life and it builds up my morale so I was doing that building up morale and just spamming beast awakening I did it like two or three times these dual swords <laughs> hey nice weapon congratulations Haseo Arcade did you choose this area because you knew yes what? you did oh who knows why I picked yeah you did <laughs> <laughs> hey, what's wrong, Hisao? Wait, don't tell me. You're unexpectedly touched and Do you know what honeysuckles symbolize? <laughs> Watch this is the best part right here. Huh? Symbolize? What's this? Are you sure about letting me have these? Flashback from roots yes. that we never saw. Please take them. Really, I want you to have them. Thanks. I, uh... <laughs> hey, Haseo, do you know what those twin swords, honeysuckle, symbolize? Just watch Adelie's... Or, not Adelie, god damn it, Alke. <laughs> watch your face here. No, what? Devoted, <laughs> oh, he's, he's, I don't know if that's a tattoos or if he's embarrassed. <laughs> now watch. Watch this. Oh my god, this is hilarious. Devoted affection. <laughs> yeah, okay, you know what? If you be my honeysuckle, I'll be your honeybee. No, uh, not in the slightest. No, not at all. You want to I've been waiting the entire Let's Play to make that joke. I'm done now. I'm, that, that's it. That, that, that's the best joke that you're going to hear in this entire project. Just don't bother watching the rest. I kid. Keep watching. I was obviously kidding. The line is going to be the title of this video. She know. At that time, I was happy just having you and Ovan with me. And look at that, I'm up to 40 minutes recording. This is ridiculous. I really didn't need anything besides that. I, I must say it was she definitely know. challenging. I, I miss you. I'll probably, um, before the next fight, once Adelie gets back online, um... I'm probably going to uh, train a little bit because I'm gonna have to level up some more. Hmm. <gasps> All right. Now I'm gonna go ahead and take a look at the lit honey toggle because I think it's a level 66 blade. Yeah. See, this is level 66. Screw it. Spin indigo. I said spin indigo, god damn it. I want seal guru anyway. 
I can equip the broad. S screw it. I'll screw. Uh, I'll screw around with that later. Anyway, we got an email to check. And sometime soon, I need to figure out if there's a good way to go and fight the doppelgangers. I do want to get those weapons, because those weapons would have been really, really helpful in, in these fights. If anything, I would really just use them for leveling up. Oh, well, if you pick the right option there, you would raise Gaspard's affection for you, so... Oh, I guess I didn't pick the right one. Speaking of Crimson Versus, let's Crimson Versus! Oh god, our deck sucks now. Bird in the Cage, a.k.a. Yukiko. It's funny because symbolism! Alright, let's check the log. Oh, they're going for snipe this t for shield this time. Okay. Uh, battle entry. Let's enter this assault deck. Deck edit. Do I have anything better than degenerating Haseo? Oh yeah, Haseo I don't. That's a good one. Um... I like that. There we go. Alright. Got that. Registered. Okay, let's get the hell out of here. I've been wasting enough time as it is. Uh, I apologize. We have one unread email. Let's see who this is from. Gaspard, I have a question. I'm worried about Celibus. He seems kind of down lately. Let's... Oh, God. Why? Why? It's odd. It's why do we have to do these? Well, we get to do a quest with these two people. In the meantime, we're going to save. Huh. I haven't... I like how... My recordings seem to be about a week apart. Like, I did the 2nd, and then the 9th, and now the 17th. It's... I, I I don't know once every week. That's seems to be. I don't I don't I don't know. I'm I'm, I'm trying to record more. I, I really am. So this has been GT. Thank you all for watching and enjoy the rest of your day.